It has been five years since Nickelback released a new album, but the guys are back with Get Rollin'. That's their 10th studio album. Chad and Ryan stopped by. We had a chance to catch up, talk about their new music, and find out how they feel about a major honor they're about to receive. Your new single, San Quentin, is a really great song to come back with. After five years, what inspired you to write a song about prison? Well, it wasn't really, I wasn't just talking about <laughs> anything. It phrased so well yeah. about that, actually. Prison, about incarceration. It wasn't necessarily about any prison, it was about that one. I, w I met the warden at a, uh, at a birthday party, and I didn't believe it was the warden. Because he, he said, hi, Chad, nice to meet you. And uh, yeah, so he obviously knew what I did. Yeah. And I said, oh, well, what do you do? What, what do you do for a living? He goes, I'm actually the warden at San Quentin. Uh -huh. And I didn't believe him. And then everyone behind him was like, that's actually the warden. And so when, you know, once I was convinced, in my head immediately pops this idea. is like, San Quentin, good song title. I turn around and do the old. Mm, one the, yeah, the absolutely, phone? just like right at the phone. And then once we got to, uh, you know, a nice aggressive, uh, heavy riff uh, in the studio. Then you start going through all the song titles and stuff, and I'm like, oh, San Quentin's interesting. And then I wind up screaming out this line, you know, can someone please keep me the hell out of San Quentin? Hmm. Um, and it just was like, oh, here we go. That was our direction, and away we went. You filmed the video this summer uh, out at SFU. Yeah. Lots of fans involved. What was that like to have them be part of the video? It was great. I mean, um, it was really hot that day, holy man. Ooh. We probably could have picked a better day. We could have picked any other day. <laughs> any well, other day, it was any other day. In BC yeah, there was, summer. yeah. You don't get a lot of that. You get a sunny day in, in Vancouver and you like, that's that's we're gonna we're gonna hit that bullseye. So no, it was great. And then people that showed up it was amazing. It was, it was nice to actually <laughs> even though we're playing for a video. Yeah. Air guitaring. <laughs> I was gonna say it's nice to play in front of people again. Well, we were kind of just dancing. It was nice to feel like it was a show. It was it, like was it felt great. like we were playing a show again. Yeah. I guess um, it, was, it was good, and I and I think it was good for the people. Like some of the people were just like, I'm so happy to be out here. I'm so happy to do this. So it was really a really nice uh, kind of group outing, I guess. So it was cool. We'd be turning up the stereo. There's a real nostalgic feel to the song, Those Days, sort of brings you back to when you actually hung out with people, right? Remember that? No DM. Yes, I do remember, remember that. that. We're all around the same age. I remember, like, I remember. Hanging out with people? Yeah, hanging out with people. Yeah. I remember I couldn't ask, I wouldn't even dare to ask my parents for a ride to anything unless I could get there myself to go and hang out with yeah. my friends. Right, yeah. Now I just Uber my children around. They text me where they need to be and at what right. time, and I show up. Right. He, we're, we're, in the, do? we're in the exactly. studio. We're exactly. in the studio, and he's like, ah, oh, uh, I gotta go. I'm like, what, what, what's wrong? Like, it sounds like an emergency. Oh, my daughter needs a ride uh, from her school four blocks to the house. Like, Uber. That's, that's an, an exaggeration, buddy. I, it's true. That's it's an like, hour drive for him yeah. to leave the studio. And just she's like, Dad, I got Dad, come get me. Like all the time. Like that's so, like when we were kids, it was bike or skateboard yeah. or these two things. Yeah. Below your waist. If got you, you couldn't figure out your own way to get yeah. there, then you just weren't going. That's exactly. My God, we sound old right now. <laughs> like, when I was young, I used to do this. <laughs> yeah. These kids these days. About the song, remembering yeah. these things as well. The one thing I do strangely miss is there was a ritual where we would go out, like when we talk about, remember trying to hit 88 to go back in time. There was a ritual where, where you would go with your friends and you would go to the video store. And I know we've progressed since then, but you go there and you, you spent time, you picked something, you went back to somebody's place, and then everybody sat and watched it in like two or three movies. And it was just a thing you we all did together all, all the time. Yep. It was, and, and yeah, you walked to the store and everything. Half did. the store was beta, the yeah. other half That's was right. VHS. <laughs> yeah. And, and so, there's the Twizzlers line in the middle yeah, while you're waiting to read so, yeah. so when we were doing that song, it was just like kind of drawing on those things where. How did we not get a blockbuster line in there? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> like we should have had a blockbuster. Yeah, line. well, we didn't have a blockbuster, so that was probably it. I'm also from Alberta. I think I've told yes. you guys this before. Uh -huh. I'm from Where Brooks. Where are you from? Yeah. I'm from Brooks. Brooks. Yeah. From Brooks. Yeah. He's Absolutely. Know. Okay. I know. Anyway, I remember that, yeah. Alberta, Brooks, and surrounding areas, Hannah and, and all of them are very proud of you guys getting into Canadian Music Hall of Fame. Aww. Thank how you very that, much. How does Thank that feel you. for you guys? It's great. Yeah, when we were talking about it, it's, it's, when we were asked this question, it's just, it's hard to answer, to be perfectly honest. I think it's, it's, it's fantastic that they even consider that for us. I mean, that's something, 
I think people would love to have in their career, and we, we do for sure, but it's like, it's one of those things where it's like, I don't even know if, we're, are we ready? Are we supposed to be there with those people? <laughs> like, I still wonder that, like, the, the peers in there. We don't deserve this. We don't deserve this. <laughs> Congratulations on all your success. Thank great you. to have you guys back. Thank great you. to have you guys out live, and great to have you here in your morning. Thanks Alberta. So Alberta. It. Bam. Boom. <laughs> Nickelback's 10th album, Get Rollin', is out now. Just ahead on your... Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked this, be sure to subscribe here, or you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.